Hey there, Saki here from Saki Tech, and in today's video, I would like to show you how to customize your Samsung Galaxy S8 always on display with some brilliant new AOD screens that you can download and install. So I'm sure most of you guys know that if you go into the settings, lock screen and security, and then always on display, you can already customize it with quite some depth. As you can see, you can choose between various clocks, calendars, and even images, and you can go in and customize even those further. But beyond that, you can actually go into the theme store and download even more AOD screens that will blow your mind away. Let's dive in. So basically what you want to do is you want to go to the theme store and there are two ways to go into the theme store. Number one, you can press and hold on the screen. Okay, and just tap wallpapers and themes or you can simply go into the settings directly and go to wallpapers and themes, which is going to launch the theme store. Once you are in the theme store, you have four options at the bottom. You've got wallpapers, themes, icons, and AODs, which stands for always on display. Just tap on that, and that's going to take you into all the different uh, always on display themes that you can download and install immediately. The only thing is not all of these things are free. So, for example, if I go to the top ones over here, uh, what you want to do if you want the free ones is simply tap on this, and choose free and if you want the paid ones which are actually better than the free ones from what I can see you can buy them they're like 50 cents 75 cents or a dollar but let's go to the free ones right now so tap on that and then just choose any one that you want tap on it and then simply download it okay this one I already downloaded but if I went to something that I never downloaded before it's gonna look like this it's gonna say download so you tap that and it downloads the AOD now the great thing with these always on displays is when you download them you have two options two different options to actually apply them on your always on display let me show you how that is so let's just pick this yin yang symbol right over here when you click apply you have two options you can either set it as a clock or as an image as a standalone image so if I apply this as a clock let's do that right now it says it's been applied and if I turn off the phone it's gonna go to that mode and it's going to show up uh, alongside the clock and everything else that's supposed to be there. But if I go in back and reapply it as an image, let me show you the difference. So back into the theme store, you click reapply and then choose image and then click OK. And this time when I turn off the phone, it's just going to come up as a standalone image, which might or might not be cooler. But yeah, that's basically all there is to it. Now, one more thing I'm going to show you guys. Uh, when you go back to the AODs over here, let's go to wallpapers, you go back to AODs. If you want to access the themes, the AOD themes that you downloaded, all you do is pull down, okay? So my uh, always on displays are right here. So I can use all of these guys, and they're absolutely gorgeous. Uh, it's nice to be able to customize your phone in infinite ways. And one more thing, anytime you actually apply an always on display, you can always go back into the settings, uh, lock screen and security, and go to always on display, and you'll see the currently applied always on display from the theme store at the bottom. So not all of them show here, which I like because it doesn't clutter the screen, but the one that you, you have currently applied shows up right here. And if you tap on it, it gives you options to further customize it if those options are available. So in this scenario, I can go back to style and I can switch between the clock version and the image version. Okay, so I can actually see what it looks like before I put it on the lock screen. So click apply. So go ahead, guys, go to the theme store and uh, start to download some of these AODs. And they are pretty neat, as you can see over here. Okay, all these different options. And like I said, if you go to the paid versions, you'll come across slightly better AOD screens, but the free ones are also amazing. For example, this one is something I would like to download and install, but unfortunately, this one you have to pay for. That's a really nice looking wolf. Uh, this one, for example, is 89 cents, all right? And that brings us to the end of the video. Make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech and give this video a thumbs up. Additionally, if you want to learn even more about the Galaxy S8 or the S8 Plus, Check out all my other videos that offer amazing tips, tricks, and features about the S8. And finally, do not forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Saki Tech Online. Guys, have a fantastic day.